I don't know. It's a stupid conspiracy theory, but hey, I'm a Gen Xer. I'm a cynic. I like conspiracy theories. Welcome to another motor vlog exceeding 35 miles an hour. <laughs> yeah, uh, you know who you are. Well, there's been a whole lot of woke talk been going on, and I'm just, uh, you know what? I was never going to weigh in on it, but uh, I figure, what the hell? You know what? I'll throw something out there, see if I can get some love, see if I can get some hate. I don't really give a crap. So, here we go. Here's my take. This is all just one big conspiracy. by either someone high up in the company uh, or the board of directors, somebody, and that's to kick a Yokin, whatever the guy's name is, uh, the CEO, to get him out. So I haven't watched a lot of these uh, videos that have been going on. So if somebody else has, uh, you know, said this, then, Sorry, but, you know, I wasn't, you know, I've watched like all of two videos on the whole thing. And I, I'm, I, I'm seriously wondering if it's just some kind of, you know what, sales numbers are down or profits are down because I don't know if they are. I mean, I, I do see those thumbnails down then, like, you know, it's a horrific uh, second quarter for, you know, second quarter numbers are horrible and stuff. But I, I don't really watch those videos either because it's just like, all right, well, great. I've got my bike already. If the company were to go belly up tomorrow, there's tons of aftermarket support for it. Not that I'm saying that I want that to happen, because, I mean, that would put a lot of American workers out of jobs, and that would not be good. So my theory, like I said, it's if, if sales are down and the company is not going in the right direction, that may be a majority of board members or stockholders uh, want the company to go I wouldn't put it past somebody to go and hey you know what we got all this documentation let's leak it to somebody because we know the outrage that it's going to cause just look at what happened with Bud Light Bud Light at one point was the number one selling beer in the US why I don't know because this stuff's disgusting I would never you know if I was dying of thirst, yeah, uh, maybe I would drink it because it's about as good as water, except it causes a headache. Whole different reason for, for why that is. That's because they use rice as an adjunct in their brewing process. It's a way to increase the alcohol, but keep it light, and it's much cheaper than using barley. Well, don't worry. Miller does it, too, but Miller uses corn. So, there's your little beer lesson on that. Okay, anyway, yeah, so do you see the outri outrage from, you know, Bud Light? And how many, you know people were, you know, ticked off, not buying. Now, it didn't get rid of their CEO, but I think their promotions department director or whatever, uh, you know, went bye-bye. But that is my conspiracy theory of the day, is that somebody's using this and leaking this out to, you know, the public and maybe certain news outlets, YouTubers, whoever. Let's get the outrage up and let's get rid of this guy and we'll put somebody else in there uh, that we think can do a better job. I don't know. It's a stupid conspiracy theory, but hey, I'm a Gen Xer. I'm a cynic. I like conspiracy theories. I'm gonna continue my ride. 
because it is a beautiful day and we have a chance of uh, some thunderstorms popping up here sometime this afternoon so we'll see what happens I get uh, caught in the old thunderstorms and um, maybe I'll record that because that's always entertaining oh man come on you couldn't have made that